Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I've done a video yesterday already, lucky you guys, and one that came out on Christmas Day that I actually filmed at the middle of December. Um, and today I am going to do another one. I'm sorry, but I am. And it is my favourite prezies that I received for Christmas from friends and family. Um, I haven't. I'm not showing all of them because you'll get you'll get bored of watching my face. But I'm going to show some of my favourites from all of the individual people that have bought for me for Christmas. And I will start now because we all know that I don't like editing out and I like keeping it all in. So. This might be long, but hopefully it's not. The tree's still up, and we've got 34th Street on the background. Because I didn't get a finish watching it before Christmas, so I thought I'd put it on in the background with no sound. Because we all know the narrative of it, and we all know the story and what people are saying, so I don't need volume, right? I'm really hungry and tired, and I was last time I did this video. Not this video, another video. But I seem to do them late at night. I don't know why. Well, usually because I'm yeah because I'm at work during the day. So that yeah that's why. Anyway, so here are some of my favourite presents. So this one is one of my favourite 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 presents. I just love it because I really like positive quotes, and I feel that this is very positive, and it's a diary. And I just love it. It's one of my favourite things that I received this Christmas. And I've already started filling it in. Not that you can see. Because I don't have much to fill in. But it's all very exciting. Be wild, young and free. I will be looking at this when I'm 90 years old. And thinking, hmm. Yeah, be wild, young and free at the age of 90. But no, I just love it, and it's such a good size as well. It's just so freaking cute. I love it. So cute. Anyway. I also received this, and it's greeting card book. It's a greetings card book, and it's just really cute because we've got a cat, as all of you know. And this is literally, it's just like little greetings cards with cats on and you can see them as thank you notes or birthday cards a cute little one there and it goes like January to December on each page of like loads of different cat cards so I've already done nearly half of my thank you cards for Christmas and Christmas was three days ago um but when you watch this it'll be Sunday so it'll be like five or six days ago anyway I think that is the best present and everyone who knows me knows that I love stuff like this because I don't have to go out and get my own to say thank you to people. Um, but the person that gave me this is going to get one of these thank you cards. So thank you for the thank you cards that you are going to receive back. <laughs> Just one, don't worry, not all of them. Um, and then, of course, the traditional snowman, chocolate white chocolate snowman that me and my best friend of 21 years do every year and I haven't eaten him yet I don't want to hurt him but I definitely probably end up hurting him and eating him by New Year Mwah. and then one of my other best friends my other best friends <laughs> got me some slippers and they're so cute they're like I want to say they're mice, but I want to also say that they look a little bit like my cat because she's grey. Well, blue, British blue. Um, but yeah, I love them. So soft. And these are some of my favourite presents. They're not all of them because we will be here until tomorrow morning. Because I will be so severely grumpy from hunger and everything that we will just be rambling on. So. This looks interesting, but they are a curling wand. I mean, it is a curling wand. It is definitely a curling wand. I just love it. It's all that I wanted, um, and it's Lee Stafford, and it is a curling iron. It looks interesting, but it is a curling iron. Um, so, yeah. 
and on Amazon it is in the sale at the moment, or at least it was before Christmas. Um, but maybe it's not now. I don't know. I haven't checked. But yeah, love it. I need to use it. I need to open it. I need to use it. But the only way that I seem to be able to get curly hair by using straighteners or something is when I've got really greasy hair. And I wash my hair every day. So that's very difficult to do. I don't know. We will see. We will see. I might have to have a donut break in a minute. You know, you have a donut break. Do you ever have that problem where you just need a donut break? I have the best pyjamas in the world, by the way. My donut pyjamas came, and I will put them on halfway through this so you'll get completely confused that I'm wearing donut pyjamas and not a bright orange top with red lipstick. So it clashes with rose gold hair. Clashes even more. So I also got... These eye sparklers, which I think are really cute, that I'm going to wear at New Year's Eve from another one of my bestie besties. You're my bestie, yeah. I just think they're really cute. So you've got like a green, a black, a gold, a pinky, and a silvery kind of colour. All of them. I am getting sleepy. I need a donut. So I've also got these cooling eye pads, which are cool because I get lots of headaches and lots of neck problems, which I moan about every single day. And I am sorry, world, I do. But this is so cool because you put it in. You put it in the. See, I would have thought of putting it into the freezer, but apparently it says put it into the fridge for one to two hours. So yeah, you put it over your eyes and it looks like a panda. I'm excited to try that out. Although on the front it does say tampons, but I think that's just another language. Let's hope it is anyway, because I ain't. Yeah, no. Never mind. Ooh. Everyone comments on this. On me. And this is one of my Christmas presents from one of my other bestie, bestie, you're my bestie. All the people that have bought me presents are my best friends so far. Yeah, from start to finish so far. Anyway, we got this coat and I love it and I wear it all the time, all the time. Not in bed, just to work or out. Um, and it's so warm. And that is from Pretty Little Thing, I want to say. Um, I saw it ages ago. Sent a picture in our group chat, and within a week, she bought it for me. Oh. The thing is, I've been looking at seeing if it's in the sale so that I can buy it for two other friends. Um, one who's gone abroad uh, travelling and the other one for my mother-in-law. But they're not in the sale. So I, I'm not buying two of them until they come down to at least a tenner. I'm only joking. Uh, £12. That's a great one. Oh, candles. Candle, candle, candles. Candles. I can't even get into the box. Mm. How do you get into it? A silly design box, isn't it? So it's from Oak Hills, England, and it smells amazing. Mm. What is it? Green fig and walnut. Have a sniff. Nope, can't smell it. Didn't think you would be able to, but I thought I would just let you see. It's really cute. Love it. And it comes in like this little box container thing that you can carry like that. And that is from my auntie and uncle. I always seem to buy her candles. And she seems to have started buying me candles. And I do like, got three or four candles over there that have no candleness left in them anymore. Um, you know, wick and wax. So, I need a new one. Thank you. Going back on to the favourite quotes section, I have this cool notebook. Because you never can have too many notebooks. And it says, dream beautiful, fly high. So, I love that. It's cute, don't you think? Donut break! Don't mind me. It may feel like I've only been gone for five seconds, but I've been gone for a good five minutes. I've changed into my 
my donut pajamas, and I'm eating a donut. And my nickname at work is Donut. Anyone see where this is going? No. Okay. Where were we? So, right, now I've had my donut. I got these for my aunt and uncle as well. Let's bake, because I do a lot of baking. Not necessarily enjoyable, just for like friends and family and charity days, but I wouldn't do it as a career like people keep asking me to and telling me to. Um, a lot of work goes into those cakes. I, I heard about this cake that costs, what is it, 10 grand or something like that? And took a week or two to make, like, no, I can't do little details and I'm not that great at it. If you look close up, you can see flaws in my cakes massively. But I got these and they're just so cute, which means I now need to use them. And I will use them. It's really easy. Do you me? Oh, anyway, so yeah, got those. Cute little gifts there. And I got the Tangle Teaser actual hairbrush. I've got the Tangle Teaser, but I've never had the hairbrush or tried the hairbrush version. Um, but it looks pretty cool. Uh, I love the Tangle Teaser because it literally does what it says. And it doesn't hurt either. Whereas I used to get massive knots in my hair because I used to have curly hair. Curly hair? Curly hair. Where am I from? I go from one language to another, to another accent. Can't even speak! To another accent, to another one. So I grew up near Birmingham and Worcestershire slash Cider Town. Then I went to boarding school in the Cotswolds where it's posh, but not so posh, but it's nice, yeah. Um, and now I work and live near London and it's like... My accents all go into one. Sometimes I sound like I'm from Essex and sometimes I sound really posh like the royal family. And sometimes I sound like Santa Claus and sometimes I sound like my dad. And sometimes I just don't speak at all. Which I'm sure everyone here is hoping for. Seeing as though all these mini little parts of the videos are going to end up being like three hours long. Well they won't be, don't worry, because you will be bored by now. Anyway, so I got that. Everyone who knows me knows that I love Game of Thrones. And this is a joint present for me and my other half from my bestie bestie of 21 years who bought me the chocolate snowman. So yeah, we got some glasses. Now, which house are you guys? Like, we had this... Harry Potter, I always felt like I should have been Gryffindor, but maybe I was more like Hufflepuff, because I was definitely not, you know, loved at school. Like, children are really, really horrible. But I was definitely not Gryffindor, because Gryffindor were cool. Um, but I feel like I could maybe pull off being a... <sighs> Tyrell, I don't think so. Because, like, Granny's too cool, isn't she? Um, I'd like to think that I could be a Stark. Definitely don't want to be a Lannister. I mean, they all get killed. Anyway, one by one, don't they? Like, more. I mean, the Starks do too, to be fair. But the Lannisters do too. So, really, don't want to be either. I'll just be a random person on the street, just chilling, going, give me donuts. I'm sure they didn't have donuts in those times, though. Maybe they did, I don't know. Probably. But, yeah. We've got glasses. I'm going to have to clear all this up after. And maybe do a bit of eating, possibly. Finish, I've got to finish something. There's something that I am in the middle of doing, making, that I need to finish. So that could be on my list to do next. Oh my god, I'm literally like... I don't wear eyeliner anymore since I was at school properly. I need to do really thick eyeliner. I don't know if my friends who might watch this remember that I used to dress like a right emo. I used to be in like heavy metal, screaming. I had a screamo heavy metal band play at my 16th birthday and they were good friends of mine at the time. We don't talk anymore but um, they've actually done really well for themselves. 
And they've been in Kerrang and everything now too. So well done guys. Um, but yeah, I'll, I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. I'm just like falling asleep. But I've got to watch 34th Street too. Oh, life is difficult, you know. But you know what? Being an adult is difficult. If I could be Peter Pan, I would be Peter Pan. Just like fly around, chilling, dipping into people's like bakeries and fridges and stuff and eating their food for them without knowing and then flying back out the window again. I've got a lot of tags happening right now on Facebook. I'm very intrigued, but I won't read them now. This is cool. This is a Polaroid mobile photo printer. So I can plug my iPhone into it and then print out a Polaroid copy. I'm really excited about that because I always wanted a Polaroid camera, but to me they're quite expensive because even if you spend £70 on the camera, which is fine, you then have to keep buying the little photo paper and they cost a fortune and you only get like 10 or 20 in a pack. He's got 50 in a pack. It's very exciting. Now well, you can never ever ask oh, more tags, Gordon Ramsay. You can never have too many socks for Christmas. These socks are so cute, they've got little penguins on them. Look, and they're in a little ball ball, and they're called totes, toasties. <laughs> totes, no, not, not like that, but ankle socks, one size fits all. I don't know if one size fits all feet because my feet had trouble growing up. I was a size seven and a half to eight by the time I was eight or seven. Eight or seven. So I had the same shoe size as my age. I never got those knee high white socks that you could have at school that were cool, that everybody got to wear, and I had to use my mum's shoes or go to Brantano's and get my footwear. Nothing wrong with that, but I'm just saying. I wish I had at least size six feet. Like I'm not t too tall to have size six feet. Why didn't anyone give me size six feet? I'm throwing everything everywhere these days. Anyway, I everyone who knows me knows I love Zoella. I watch Alfie, Casper, all of them. Uh, not all the time, I'm not like obsessed or anything, but I don't know, I feel like me and Zoe are very similar in personality wise, we're both very odd, in a good way, obviously, um, but no, I do feel like we're very similar in um, how we act and everything, and that's pretty cool, but everybody now buys me Zoella everything, and I got perfume as well, um, Zoella perfume from my bestie bestie you're my bestie um for christmas and i got this from my second mom my best friend's mom and got that yeah i got this which i'm very happy about because i actually was talking about this hat maybe even in my head i don't know but i did want this hat and the bubble is even bigger than i think it's not that small it's actually big and fluffy and then I can put my warm drink in it, usually a hot chocolate or a fudge hot chocolate. I'm not one for coffee or tea or alcohol, really. So I'd probably just have water in it or a hot chocolate. Thank you. Now, you can't really go wrong with fur, can you? Like, how cool is this? feel like a lady of leisure when I wear something like this. Or you can really see my hair stands out now. <sighs> lady of leisure in my fur scarf by one of my bestie besties, my bestie. Yeah. I like these pyjamas. I feel like I might get healthy now I'm wearing them because I can't eat these pyjamas. I might get sick of donuts. Sick of waking up seeing donuts all the time. Oh, I've been tagged in more things. It's very exciting. So yeah, thank you for that. Got that one. Oh, this is for your sleep. Yes. Oh. 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 Oh.
Oh, I might be asleep before you. So this I got from my honorary grandparents. How cool. Wait, I should have shown the sleeve. It's pretty cool. And... Oh, hallelujah. That's a lot of colours. Just thinking, is there one I can wear on for New Year that's gold? There is. And there's a black for smoky eye. Ooh, ooh. And then you can pull out the drawer at the bottom, as I'm doing here. And it goes into nail varnish, lip glosses, a buffer. I want to say that's an eyeliner. But how cool! Oh, I really like those colours. It's like a Christmassy colour. Now, I get my nails done um, shellac. But when I finally decide not to have shellac, I will be probably using the Christmassy colours all year round. I just love, love the effect. Thank you. So, so far. So, got the perfume. Obviously, I smell, and that's when you get friends' perfume, right? Because I was actually running out. I'm only joking. I was running out, and I was so excited when I opened this. From again, one of my best friends. Um, I'm just gonna shut up. And stop saying best friends because you all know now that these are all from my best friends and my family. So. Um, yep, yeah, I got these. I'm so excited to sniff and smell and use. Thank you very much. Oh, hello, Daddy. Mm, my cat's come to play. So, I got this as well, and it's really cool. It's really pretty. It's like a Vogue, the Vogue version. Um, and I'm using it for New Year's Eve. With my outfit, I've actually gone all out and actually got an outfit this year, like a proper one. I'm not wearing my like my normal like leather trousers, black biker coat, and boots. I'm actually wearing a dress. So this is going to be really interesting. But inside, I think from what I can remember, there are actually Christmassy kind of colours. Like how cool is that brush? So cool. And then you get like a little. I can't even read that. Liquid blender cleanser. Sim sample size. That's <laughs> simple size. Not for resale, but sharing is okay. I don't share food, so I'm not going to share this. Anyway, put that back in there so I don't lose it. So we've got like a pressed eyeshadow. You can't really see the colour. There you go. And then this is a palette I think to put them in which would make sense oh my god this colour is insane this is the colour I'm wearing New Year's Eve now like you can't really see oh, oh, I'm gonna have to try and get this colour up on the screen properly because it is amazing can you see it yeah you can a little bit it's kind of like a uh, cherry glittery kind of colour eyeshadow and I love it. So you get loads of little like eyeshadows and then you get like the palette to put it in. I think that's what it's for. Makes sense. Might not be though. But yeah. Thank you very much for that. Make sure I keep that out so I remember it. Do you want to come say hello? Do you want to come say hello? Hello. Now she's no Nala, which is Zoe and Alfie's pug. But she matches my pyjamas and she's become very loving lately, haven't you? Yep, yeah, that's you in the mirror. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I don't like that view. Thank you. Oh, no, I feel like you're going to go on the screen. Say bye-bye, Jess. Bye-bye. Let's put you down. Normal human being. Okay, so with the Vogue little bag, which I guess you can use as a makeup bag, but I use it as like a little handbag on night out. Um, more issues than Vogue, like notebook. This is amazing because I really do have more issues than Vogue. Not actual issues of Vogue, more issues than Vogue. 
who doesn't have issues like my issue is that I eat too much food and wonder why I'm bloated all the time I people think I've got IBS but maybe it's just that I'm just greedy pig I could just be a greedy 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 pig but yeah I really like this it's really cute thank you for that one um these are cute I do love Beauty and the Beast like the little chip socks and then Mrs. Potts. Oh, they're so cute. Mm. So I've got those. So I've got some banana hand milk, which is hand cream, smelling like it smells like those banana sweets that you can get from the shop. Uh, slash banana milkshake. It smells amazing. You want to eat it. Um. Be happy, be bright, be you. This cute little necklace. The little star on it. I love that. And then, of course, the usual uh, Primark gift vouchers, Zara home vouchers. Um, because everyone knows I love Primark, so I'm very happy about that one. And then these little... Swarovski. I said it right first time, I think. Earrings, which I'm wearing on New Year's Eve. They are beautiful. Very lucky girl. That's that bag done. So I've got two more presents to show and then I'm done. And then I'm putting it all together and uploading it for Sunday evening. The reason why it's for Sunday is when you'll be watching this is because um, one of my closest friends is coming over from Ireland and a present I received from our mutual best friend um, I got from her for Christmas she's getting from her for Christmas so I don't want her to see it um, because even though she knows that she doesn't know she's getting it she might be like, oh, that diary or something, because she does like diaries. So I'm not uploading this until Sunday. Yeah. So this is another one of my favourite prezies. I was, we were both, me and Jodie, we were both so, I think we were gobsmacked, um, so happy and so loved that we got this each. Um, I've been trying to look for a proper material advent calendar for my dad for months and they cost a fortune like i was looking at one that was like three pounds and it was one star i'm not gonna get one star for my dad it needs to be at least two no i'm joking it needs to be at least five um so i didn't get one i used one of my other ones you're right there jazzy it's my coat smell nice so i got one of my old ones i got dad to wash it and then I individually wrapped him licorice all sorts in the cling film and put it in each individual space, pocket, whatever you want to call it. But we came into work on the 1st of December and our boss and his wife had bought us these handmade advent calendars, including the string and the wood. They're just so beautiful and they're hand stitched and sewn together and machine stitched too. So if you want to have a look at this lady's work. I think it's a lady. I don't know. I haven't actually looked into it, but I think she is. Um, I don't think it's a man. It might be a family business. Um, it's called creative-stitching.co.uk. So go check them out. Pleasure to be your lily pad. You're welcome. So yeah, I love it. And it can go away until next Christmas now, and I've got it at home. Javi, you're in the you're in the camera. You need to go down there. This is a very, very, very special present. Um, this was my husband's cousin slash married now. I guess she is my cousin. Not blood related. But we're cousins, we are family. Um, she did help Connor's mum. Oh, I was thirsty, I'm sorry. 
that felt really nice though. Oh. So yeah, um, she helped Connor's mum get the photos and then she made, Marie, Connor's mum made this. Um, and yes, I cried when I opened it. Uh, so it's when we, oh, Blair, first got together. So when me and my dad went and helped do their new garden, their new home, in like 2010. And then when Connor proposed to me in Whistler, in Canada, 2012. And then 2017, when we finally, finally tied the knot. And then these are from like, table arrangements and stuff. And then you've got like the pegs. And then this is quite special because the confetti down here is the confetti that was dried by my mother-in-law for our wedding and this was saved over and these petals are from my nan's rose bush that my granddad planted in their garden when she was poorly um, and then she passed away and it was his prize, prior possession. So um, yeah, and now they've both passed away it means even more and it's also got petals from my mum and dad's garden too so very 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 special thank you very much it's so cute are you helping well i don't think you are i'm having a very long day now i realize i'm so sorry hopefully it's a little bit funny but yeah so those are my favorites of 2017 christmas uh, it's nearly my birthday. Only kidding. Well, it is, but I'm only kidding. Um, I hope you all have. See, I can't speak. I'm so tired. I've gone into a farmer accent. I need to speak properly. <clears throat> Telephone voice on now. Um, yes, I hope you all have. Oh, you're sneezing. You're allergic to me. Yeah, most people are. Um, I hope you all have a really, really good new year. And I will see you all in 2018. Let me know if you actually like these videos and if you think that people will watch them because I don't know. I just talk and talk and talk and just don't shut up. So it'd be good to have some feedback. Thanks, guys. Have a great one. And don't forget to subscribe, like, uh, not like, but still subscribe if you can. Um, from me and my, my cute kitty who's about to get squished because she's behind me. See you Say bye-bye. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Well, <laughs>